Good morning. This is Debbie with the Food Prepping Channel. And it is, oh my gosh, <laughs> 5 to 12. I get later and la at l later and later in taking my blood sugar. Um, my medicines get so messed up or whatever. I have my alarm set every morning for 10 o'clock to take my medicines. But something will happen. Um, and I'll get something to eat or I won't have something to eat and have to fix something to eat before I can take my medicine or I've lately I've been having a real problem of I fall asleep at night at like nine o'clock then I wake up at two o'clock and stay up until like six o'clock this morning it was 6 30 um, when I went back to bed so it's just getting later and later for me <laughs> to take my blood sugar and it's not something that I normally do because believe you me I'm used to get up at 5 30 and now it's just my whole situation I guess has just changed and for some reason I like being up in the middle of the night um you know that I always say Nights are for, it was a song when I was growing up, Nights are Forever Without You. And to me, it's just when I'm here alone or something like that, it's just hard at night. So I wake up and I'll answer my comments or I'll do this or I'll do that. And I don't go back to bed till in the morning when it's almost light. So, all right, here I go. I'm going to do my, check my blood now and... Some people are still saying to do it on the side, but I can't do it on the side. But I can just barely put my finger over the edge. And I'll go on and use this finger. That was the... I'll just barely put... And you can see the little hole there. And I'll just barely put my finger on there. And then push this little button. And that's going to make the needle pop out. And if I do it at the very top, just like this... It doesn't hurt. Now, whether I got blood that time, uh, nope. No blood, just a little bitty drop. I guess I could, yep, there, there it comes. They always did this at the doctor's office, so I guess it really doesn't make any difference, but I gotta take this out and put it back in because it went. Okay, there you go. Now, let's get this drop of blood and let's see what my blood sugar is. Era. Meter was not ready. Oh, my gosh. Did y'all see that? I had put the strip in, and it had gone back to the numbers that it was supposed to. And then it reads error after I put the blood on it. So now I'm going to have to stick myself again, I guess. Nope, blood's still coming out. Of that. See, that did not hurt one little bit. So, just barely putting your finger on there alright see it's ready alright now it's counting down so let's see what my blood sugar is 146 okay that's still in the the limit that the doctor told me so that she wants it in so I'm excited about that but I did take my um, medicine this morning at 6.30, my nightly medicine, because I'm all off on that. Usually I take all of my medicines in the morning and my night medicines in the afternoon, I mean at night, and now this morning I took my night medicine at 6.30, and tonight I'll take my morning medicine at 6.30. So... <laughs> but anyway, you saw my blood sugar is 146. If you have any um, comments or any suggestions or anything for anyone that's got diabetes, don't forget to write them or to put them in the comment section below. And um, you have a good day. And if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. If you'd like to be a part of my Facebook page, you can find me at facebook.com slash forward slash 
dot I mean Facebook dot com forward slash food prepping I one word F O O D P R E P P I N G and you can comment there or you can comment on my YouTube but make sure you come along and join along with us and put your blood sugar down and I'll talk to you later. Bye.